Hey everyone, it's Wednesday the 21st of February and it's now 3.40 in the afternoon. Right, in this video we're going to attempt to power up those laptops uh, that I showed in the um, unboxing video. So I've not, they're not in any particular order on here, I've just sort of picked them up from the lounge, brought them in here, dumped them on the worktop so, I've also got the box of uh, laptop adapters out, so hopefully we'll be able to uh, find some that will fit. I've already found one for the Sony. So we've got an advent here, which is, you can actually get a model number from this one, it's the 7109B. Right, so I need a 20 volt power adapter that's going to fit that. Not even close. That's for a Dell. That's for a Dell. And I'm hoping one of those will fit the apple. Should, they're the same connectors. <coughs> I know that one's not going to fit any of them. Do you fit? No. Nope. Not big enough. This one might. does, but is it the correct voltage? It's 19 volt, I'd rather fire the 20. I'll keep that just to the side for the moment. And an OVO one here fits. That's a 20 volt, we'll try that one then. One. I did get the um, power cables that I would need. So I was uh, somewhat prepared. <laughs> okay, plug it in. I'm not seeing any uh, lights on. It did do something. The first one's uh, powered up. <laughs> yeah, that's not going to boot, is it? Is it? Oh my god. Will it actually boot into Windows? Have I actually got a working laptop here? I was actually thinking this one was a bit newer than Windows XP, but apparently not. Ah, so we've got three users. Are they password protected? Uh, it doesn't look like, at least not this first one. Throws on me. It's not that noisy, that hard drive is quite quiet. This user is just called Jaguar. Start up sound, will it do anything else? So far, so good. It's taken its time though. Nope. Yeah, 
Okay, I'm going to shut this down. There is a lot of personal info on that. <laughs> Whoa, there's QuickTime player on it. I've not seen that for a while. Okay, so that's pass. Thumbs up. It actually boots. I'm not going to look at the other two um, users because probably got some personal info on them as well. I'll have to do that off camera. Well, also though, I've got a Lenovo adapter here. I've really got to remember to put my phone on silent. Uh, it's going to take forever to shut down as well. Oh, there we go. Charge light is flashing. I don't know if it's going to take a charge though, but I will leave those two together because I will, uh, just for curiosity, see if any of these will charge. Right, Acer is next. It's a 19 volt. I don't think I've got one that's going to fit that. That's um, looks like quite a large power socket. Yeah, I, I don't think I've got one that's going to fit it. That one's gone in, but whether that actually works or not, I don't know. That's quite a short one. We'll use a longer one. Pardon me. Well, we'll plug it in and we'll see if it works. Oop. Can't see any lights. It has turned on. Oh, look at that. Busted screen. Sounds like we've got a disc in here. We have got a disc in here. Circus Work 6th Form, NGA, Tuesday 25th, 2017. Someone's college work. <laughs> no, I have got a load of LCD panels spare so I may have one that will fit this I suppose what I could do as the monitor is on plug an external monitor into it and see if it's going to do anything in Windows 7. I don't know if you can see that. Look. <laughs> wow. So apart from being in quite a mess, um, it is another working one. That is making a squeak every once in a while. Like um, perhaps the girls' college class. And again, I'm not going to look through that just in case there's uh, any really personal stuff on there. I'm just going to shut it down. Oh, 
when this is off it is actually quite hard to tell that that screen's been smashed so that can go down into the uh, working pile right now we've got the HP that is a tiny little adapter I think I know what one I would need <coughs> I don't know where it is. You're too big, aren't you? Yeah, Mars too big. Mailer's too big. That's going to be Mars too big. Oh, I thought that was going to fit, but it's a bit too small. Right! Oh, Hopefully I can find something in here with a smaller... one to last and uh, try and bodge something together in a little bit so I can find my uh, what few um, universal adapters I have got. I've got this one that's all tied in a freaking knot somehow. And I've got that one. That's not going to fit it is it? No. Busted up anyway, that one. <coughs> it is uh, about time that I got a new universal adapter. Nineteen and a half volts. Found one. Always the end of it. Just make sure we aren't putting out any more than nineteen and a half volts. Spot on! I honestly didn't think I was going to have one. Snap. Right. Will this do anything? Where's the on button? This has got a smash screen. HDMI, so I can't. This one does appear to be dead. I always thought even with a damaged screen that would have lit up. So well, I'm lucky with that one. That one's dead. 
Right, now I have got the power supply I need for this one, which is here. And that is the Sony. Bloody cough. Right, plug it in. Plug it in. Got lights. So once a thumbs up, it's actually doing something. The operating system not found, so the hard drive is dead or they've taken it out. That's a pass though. The battery held charge for a split second there as well. The screen catch might have just broke on it. <laughs> Three out of five so far is not bad. Now, right. I don't need these, do I? Let's chuck them in there. Out of the way. Get this on the floor out of the way. there nicely, so the charger fits. I'm not able to hear by my cat from running away in the background. Bless their little cat and socks. Okay, so I've got an Apple logo. It's not very bright though. Is it booting into anything? It does appear to be booted. Don't tell me I've got a working Apple laptop. At this angle, there's like a dark patch. Goes like that. I don't think the screen is that good on it. It's still loading. Do you think it's going to do anything? Oh, you can see the dark patch on camera. Wow. Cursor do anything. Keyboard's not there. Uh, that might be the problem with the keyboard isn't working. <coughs> Why has the screen just gone black? Probably do with a USB keyboard, maybe. Let's see if a USB input works.
Yeah, I'm not going to get into it without uh, a password. Although it does say switch user. But I don't have a USB mouse at hand, I don't think. I'd have yeah, I'd have to pause to go and get that. That's <laughs> Bear with me one second. Right back, I found a USB mouse, but uh, well, I did. There it is. I'm not going to get be able to get in though because I need the password. Really, you need to put a password in to shut the thing down. Will it shut down if I hold the button? Yep. Yeah. Well, I'm actually going to leave that one on charge because I'm curious to see if it will take a charge. For a moment, the light on the charger connector there changed green. <clears throat> so that is, I don't think that's bad, you know. Four of them powered up out of five. Um, unless that little one did power up. There's no hard drive in it. Sorry, Smudgy Boy, you're hiding a screwdriver. I don't think this has got screws in it. No, it hasn't. drive's been removed. The RAM's been removed. With force, because they've actually bent the um, heat pipe for the processor. One of these speakers are missing and it's actually busted the wires. This one's toast. I don't think this one's gonna work again. Screen cable wasn't even connected. In that case, then we'll reconnect that. Don't know what round type this will be. three. We'll just stick one in. Uh, it was the Lenovo one, wasn't it? Let's see if I can find that again.
I'm not looking for the wrong one, I think. It's not that one. It's this one, I think. Yeah, someone uh, clearly was not careful when they took this one apart, they just ripped, uh, ripped everything out. <laughs> Yeah, switch cable back in. That might be the other reason it was totally dead. There we are. Cable is full. Yep, we are dead. Um, keyboard for the one there though. And I'm pretty certain that everything else is no good. Too big. Might be the other reason it was scrapped. Maybe that's why the screen is broken. Perhaps it died on someone and they punched it. Even the fan is all unplugged. else I can salvage on that. The processor is soldered to the motherboard. Let's <coughs> see. Just looking into uh, taking out charge socket and it's actually uh, clamped in via the hinge Give you a 
So there's water damage on that as well. <coughs> the rest of that can do. Never mind. One of them being totally dead is not bad. Four of them being good in my book is a win. So there we go. I'm actually glad this worked. A bit miffed that the mouse and keyboard for some reason don't work. But it works from USB. Either way, I've got a third uh, Apple Mac to play with. Suppose I should uh, figure out how figure out how to open this up. Let's see if I could fix this. Maybe some water or something was dropped on it. Those keyboards don't like that because then they get all that greeny corrosion underneath them and they stop working. <clears throat> Hopefully that's a decent little uh, Wi-Fi card there. I mean, surely the 50 quid's got to be worth it for the Apple. It technically does boot. I can't get it or anything because I've got the password, but it does power up and charge and... <coughs> what well, USB keyboard and whatnot works, so I could still use it. You know, it's not imperative I fix the uh, keyboard and mouse, but it would be nice. Anywho, quite a short video, <clears throat> I think. <laughs> so uh, thanks a lot for watching everyone, I hope you found the video interesting. We have a smudge in the shop now. <clears throat> if you did, you know what to do. Thumbs up if you liked the video, thumbs down if you didn't. Subscribe if you liked what you see and you want to see more. Um, Subscribing is totally free and of course in the video description down below I will leave links to my other two YouTube channels um, My discord server and my uh, Twitch channel so feel free to check all those out as well. Anyway, see you in the next video. Bye